Lynn. So yesterday, I've just, well today actually, I, I sent the thing out yesterday and I just scribbled down the 10 exercises that we're going to do. So it's a bit of an ad lib one, I don't know what number I'm going to call it, I hadn't really thought. But it's quite tough, and I thought, because I figured I needed it, so. Oh, that's good, as long as it's good for you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about us, we'll be fine. Yeah, well, you, I don't know what you're doing, do I? You could be there drinking gin and tonic. <laughs> and you'll never know. No, I won't. No, because if you do, I like seeing people, but if I, if I dare get you to switch your video on, it could, it, it's only got two bars, it could crash. Just make sure nobody slurps while they're knocking back their wine. Yeah, I know. <sighs> Welcome on Darren James' YouTube channel. So we're recording this from a farmhouse on the Isle of Purbeck. So it's an ad, ad hoc one, so um, it'll be uploaded at some point. And hello, Joe. Joe's trying to come in. Hello, Joe. I'm here, Good. but I turned everything off because I was worried about your yeah. Wi-Fi. Yeah, that's great, yeah. Well, I'll, I'll mute myself, but I can see you and I am not drinking wine. If I just stop moving halfway yeah. through and we do lose what the, the little signal I've got, then yeah. obviously let me know. I'll sort of just carry on on my own. <laughs> well, when I, I plank for 10 minutes and I realise that we're not supposed to be doing a 10-minute plank, I'll tell you then, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if I completely freeze, yeah. All right. Well, I should disappear now. I'll okay. speak to you at the end. <laughs> right, we'll get started then. It is ten past. All right, start watch. So hopefully we'll get through the next half an hour or so. Right, so ad hoc one. Scribble out this afternoon. So we're going to do heel taps. We're going to do dead bugs. We're going to do oblique leg raises. We're going to do flutter crosses. We're going to do V-sits. Then we're going over some low plank rollouts, so up into some high plank shoulder taps, starfish, crunch, <coughs> hence the uh, zoom pasco, ab runners and pikes. <laughs> so that'll be a good finish, it? Right, are we happy? I'm gonna have to assume that you are, so. Ready then, so first one's gonna be those heel taps, so on our backs. Nice. I've downloaded the timer onto the main iPad, so that's gonna do the timing whilst the phone is clearly busy. Ready, heel taps then. Three, two, one. And go, so from that bent knee position on our backs, don't strain your neck, bring your feet together. We're looking screen wise. So yeah, I've shuffled the furniture around in the farmhouse. This is the dining room we're actually in. Oh, this floor is really warm. It's lovely to walk around on though. In socks or a barefoot. And that's our first pause. It's going to adjust the screen slightly for the YouTube. Better. And the second one's going to be dead bugs. So it's a 30-30 accumulator, 10 exercises. Ready on heel taps. And go. Yeah, the clock sounds are slightly different as so I set up the timer this afternoon. <coughs> I don't risk getting the phone to do it, else we'll probably lose everything. And dead bugs, go. In at number two, dead bugs. So yes, I've overindulged all weekend. Did do a run on Saturday. A walk out yesterday. Other than that, it's been too much food, too much booze. And it's a pause. <coughs> Good stuff. So you have to tell me if I make a mistake or anything goes wrong, because I won't know. 
Uh, and then we're going to go to those oblique leg raises. Obviously, each time with those, we'll be changing sides. Oh, I need to tick these off, that's what will get super confusing. Round three then. Heel taps, and go. Now, I don't know what number I'm going to call this when I do upload it. It's the holiday special. Yeah, lovely, lovely big farmhouse though, and there's a couple of other ones, smaller ones, on the same site. But that's it, there's nothing else here, but it's on. And dead bugs go. It's on National Trust land, right by RSPB Arn. We own the rest of the land around here, I think. So there's lots of, there's lots of bird watchers around. Other than that, you don't see anybody. There was a hide literally uh, literally three minutes walk from here. So I went up there, went into the hide, and there was lots of very uh and oblique legs, one buttock or the other, and go. Lots of very serious people with very very long lenses in there looked very strangely at me, so I didn't think I should hang around very long. <coughs> They were looking for avocets or something. And pause. And then we're going to do those flood crosses. <coughs> Apparently, the RSP Beyond is where the last, I think it's Spring Watch, came from. with Chris Packham and, is, is it Kate Humble who still does that? I can't remember. And heel taps, and go. Apparently, yeah, that's where it, that's where it came from. So I think this one's gonna be fairly tough. The last three certainly are. Dead bugs, I must have gone. And oblique legs, change sides. Oh, desperately need some exercise. And flutter crosses. So we either hands under the bum to pull that lower back or across the chest with a tougher version. Make sure the knees are locked out. And flutter crosses. And that's our pause, well done. And then we come up onto our bums for those V sits, either hands on the floor facing forward or across the chest. Ready then? So five in a row now already. And heel taps. And go.
Short bar completely open that window. Trouble is, when I stop, I'm gonna to have to help freezing to death. It's a cold night, I think it's gonna be nearly freezing it. Close. Yeah, dead bugs, go. That's it, arm, opposite leg, keep them as straight as you can. Lovely old dead bugs. And that's oblique legs. And go. Change your backside to course. Each time. Good stuff guys, I hope it's still there. And flood crosses. And then we've got those V sits. Cuffle your bums and V-sits, go. Hands on the floor facing forward or across the chest for the tougher version. Legs all the way straight. our break. Well done. Oh, it is warm here now. And low plank roll out to next. So if we're going over onto our fronts for the first time, just for two on our fronts, the rest are on our backs. Round number six. <coughs> Ready? And go. Your taps. Yeah, I suppose, I think it's, I think we've got up to 67 overall. I suppose I should make it 68, but I don't really want to, because those are 40 40s. So maybe I'll make it number 70. Don't know what to think about that. But it will get uploaded, and dead bugs, go. It's nice to have some in other locations. Uh, and oblique legs, uh, training over again. Well done, guys. Yeah, and flood crosses. And up for V-sits.
Yeah, and roll over. Uh, low plank roll out from that low plank, up onto your toes, without raising the bump. Come through the shoulders. Great one for the upper rectus abdominis, those upper abs. And pause. So then there we shoot straight back up into high plank for our shoulder taps. And then we've got a tough three ones, uh, three at the end. Oh, well done. <clears throat> Ready, heel taps. And go. Of course, I do remember we've done this before via 4G, but that was from home and the signal's stronger than it is here. Don't get a huge amount in the middle of a nature reserve. It tends, tends to spoil the vista somewhat if they put up a transmitter. Yeah. And dead bugs, go! Hoping I'm still with you all. Still see all your names, so. Um, and oblique. Oh, which side was I? I think I'm back this side. Well done, guys. And flutters, flutter crosses. Good stuff, keep it going. And up for those V-sits. And low plank rollouts. High plank and shoulder tap. Keep the weight right under, the, right over those hands. Keep the bum down. We're not down. We're dogging from a high plank position and try and resist body rock. And that a pause? I think so. Did I miss one there? If I did, somebody shout. It seemed too quick. No, maybe I didn't. <coughs> okay, eight in a row. Switch me, team. Uh, so I'll bring it in those starfish this time. Woo, heel taps. Well, that's too bad. And go.
And dead bugs. And go. <sighs> And up for oblique legs. Uh, this side. Go, go, go. <sighs> well done, guys. I'd say looking strong, but I can't see any of it. <coughs> And flat crosses. <coughs> Lock those knees out. Looks like we're over 20 minutes already. Well done. That doesn't seem like it. And up for V sit. All the way out, keep them strong. And roll over, low plank roll out, hop on those toes and go. That high plank and shoulder tap. Good stuff. Then we're going over for those starfish. And today's Zoom code word, password. Roll over, starfish, arms wide, legs wide. Up we come, meet the toe, meet the opposite foot. Torso comes all the way off. Starfish crunch. Well, those are more testy, aren't they? building now. Well done, we're in our break. So, <coughs> excuse me. So we've just got ab runners and the dreaded pikes. Here we go then. Round number nine on this 30-30 accumulator. Heel taps, go. Thirty-thirty accumulated with no name. <coughs> and dead bugs go. <sighs> Yeah. 
Off those oblique legs. And go. Straight in. Well done, down with those flat crosses. And up for those V-sits. Go, go, go. Nearly there, guys. We are getting there. Like a furnace here. And over we go, low plate roll outs. Look at those toes, nice and strong. High plank and shoulder tap. And back over, starfish. Spread the legs, spread the arms. A torso all the way off. And then we've got those ab runners. Now remember, ab runners ideally keep both feet off the floor throughout. If you can't, the foot is not in use, leave on the floor, then obviously swap them over. Engage, and up we go, meet the opposite knee, up runners. Oh, I'm feeling that now. Much needed. And our last break then. Well done, that wasn't feeling too bad till a couple of rounds ago. Now to me, that's just changed. So and then we're gonna finish with the dreaded pikes, everybody's favorite. And remember, bike is not a V-up. We're trying to get the torso to meet the legs in that pike position, if we can. Right, last round then. 26 minutes as I start the clock, go. Heel taps, last time. Call from the farmhouse. And dead bugs, go, last time. Nearly there. Keep strong. Yeah. 
And the bleak legs. Nearly there. <clears throat> and down for those flat crosses. Well done, keep them going. Yeah, and up to those V-sits, I think. That's right. We're doing face forward this time. Uh, and low plank rollout. Off we go. Nice and strong through those shoulders. All but done. High plank and shoulder tap. Nice and strong, strict in that body movement. So we've just got those three to come. Starfish, ab runners, and pike back to back. There we go, starfish. Go, go, go. So all three of these require torso to lift off the floor. <coughs> if at all possible. And switch to those ab runners. Engage and go. Come up through the obliques. Meet in the opposite. In the opposite. Each time meet in a knee. Twisting toward it. Control it up and down. Last one coming up. Now if you possibly can. Legs and arms are going to start the entire time. We're going to come up and meet them uh, back down. If you cannot get your torso off, then turn it into a B up. Like so. But if at all possible, pike. And control them up and down. Getting into that nice, strong pike position. Oh. That's burning now after those ab runners and starfish crunch. Engage for that pike, ignore that buzzer. Just head. Four minute on these pikes. Try not to hit the floor. Keep them going, guys. Last one of the holiday session. about round six, I thought I was all right. All of a sudden. And stop. I think they're looking at the time, I don't think I missed any. Clock is stopped. Ooh. Well done, what do you think of that? Well, I think the three at the end were a bit mean. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>
Looking back on it, Joe, I, <laughs> I, can't, I kind of uh, kind of agree with you. <laughs> yeah, that was tough. <laughs> it didn't seem too bad, and then it just, I don't know, I think it was about round six or seven, it just went, oh, I'm feeling that now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think the last three were just a little bit similar muscles, maybe. Yeah, they are, but, yeah, because they're all going to involve torso coming up, so yeah, well, which takes a lot in itself. So yeah, we'll have six packs tomorrow. Well, you, well, you should have after that. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, that wasn't too bad a connection, was it? No, I'm amazed. Two bars, um, four G from a oh, on, from a window I managed to hold, but it did. <laughs> Right. We'll Has you. the farmhouse got an, a number, Darren? Uh, you should call it whatever it is visited rather than revisited. Oh, I could. It's got a name. It's called Middle Beer. Call it Middle Beer Visited rather than number 66 Revisited. That's a really good idea. I'm going to do that. We won't number it. We'll name this one. <laughs> there we go. Because that's quite a good one if you want... As Joe says, if you want six pack in the morning, that's the one to do a yeah. few times, isn't it's it? Really and we'll be able to yeah. find it easily. Really there. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I will. Right I'm going to take your advice. You, I'm going to call it middle beer. Yeah. You, um, you've been stuffing your face and you're going to have a gin and tonic there. We're all going to starve for the rest of the evening, so it's a bit unfair, really. <laughs> you too could have a gin and tonic. <laughs> I can't yeah. recommend anything. <laughs> Well, thanks, Darren, for doing that. We'll see you in two weeks. Yeah, yeah, see you soon. Yeah, see you in two weeks. Cheers, Joe. Nice to see you. Well on the YouTube channel. I'll see you real soon. Hope you enjoyed that.